New tonight, our big story. Uh, an upstate lawmaker is now making a push to bring a big gun manufacturer to South Carolina after the company has threatened to leave its headquarters in Colorado. Now, that move could bring hundreds of jobs and how about this, tens of millions of dollars to the Palmetto State. But there is a big if attached to all of this. And Fox Carolina's Derek Dellinger is live in our newsroom tonight to explain what's going on. Derek? And that big if is if they decide to move. The company has said publicly that they would consider moving and upstate representative Jeff Duncan says if they're serious, so is he. This story begins across the country in Colorado. This is the Magpul plant just outside of Denver, where much of the business is concentrated on making these. A 30-round magazine designed for the AR-15 uh, and the military M4 and M16 platforms. And it accounts for about half of their business. But if some Colorado lawmakers have their way, the very sale, possession, or transfer of these magazines could be outlawed there. Back in the upstate, Congressman Jeff Duncan of Lawrence says he sees this as an opportunity. All I'm saying is you won't find a better environment than South Carolina and we would love to have you. Duncan has written a letter to Magpul saying they should consider a move to South Carolina. And while it might sound like a political ploy, it's not that far-fetched. The company says they're considering moving out of Colorado. You may be well-intentioned with this legislation, however, the loophole that exists is in the heart of man. There's a tremendous economic impact on the local communities. It's not just the businesses themselves, it's all the support business. Magpul's economic impact to Colorado is expected to be $85 million this year. It employs around 200 people, with 400 more as suppliers. Duncan says if Colorado doesn't want that, then Magpul should come to a that needs the jobs and the money, and is already quite friendly. Well, we already have FN, um, Fabricate National, in Columbia. They make farms there. We've got farm manufacturers in South Carolina. Uh, we've got plastic injected and blow molding companies that uh, make components like Magpul makes. So we would love to have them anywhere in the state. Now we tried reaching out to Magpul tonight for a comment. So far they have not returned our calls, but we should add Duncan has also reached out to Remington, another gun manufacturer, to have them move their headquarters from New York to South Carolina. So, Derek, I was wondering, okay, if they go with their promise to leave Colorado, you can imagine we're not the only state who right. would potentially be putting out feelers on them coming here. Have you heard about other states who've actually been throwing their name into the mix? Yeah, so far, Texas is another state that has reached out to them, and so far, neither have heard back from the company yet. Either way, though, it's a very short list, and that might bode well if they decide to move. All right, Fox Carolina's Derek Dellinger yeah. tonight. South Carolina throwing out the West.